Tycho. Here we are again with another fun-filled math challenge. Today we're going to learn about vertically opposite angles. Wow, this sounds so challenging. It is, but very interesting once you learn about them. So let's begin our lesson. Vertically opposite angles. Introduction. When two lines intersect each other, then the opposite angles formed are called vertically opposite angles. Vertically opposite angles are always equal. Let's see a few examples. In this figure, two straight lines AB and CD intersect at a point O. Four angles are formed at O. Here angle P and angle S are one pair of vertically opposite angles. Angle P equals angle S. Angle AOD equals angle BOC. These are different notations but both mean the same. Angle Q and angle R are another pair of vertically opposite angles. Angle Q equals angle R. This is the same as angle AOC equals angle DOB. In this figure, two straight lines EF and GH intersect at a point O. Four angles are formed at O. Here angle W and angle Y are one pair of vertically opposite angles. Angle W equals angle Y. This is the same as angle EOH equals angle FOG. Angle Z and angle X are another pair of vertically opposite angles. Angle Z equals angle X. This is the same as angle EOG equals angle HOF. In the figure, two straight lines AB and CD intersect at point O. Four angles are formed at O. Here angle AOC and angle DOB are one pair of vertically opposite angles. Also, angle AOD and angle BOC are another pair of vertically opposite angles. Here, angle AOC and angle DOB are equal. Angle AOD and angle BOC are equal. In the figure, angle AOC equals 60 degrees and angle AOD equals 120 degrees. Find angle DOB and angle BOC. Vertically opposite angles are always equal. Angle AOC and angle DOB are vertically opposite angles. Since vertically opposite angles are equal, angle DOB equals angle AOC. So angle DOB equals 60 degrees. Angle AOD and angle BOC are vertically opposite angles. Since vertically opposite angles are equal, angle BOC equals angle AOD. So angle BOC equals 120 degrees. So buddy, I hope you are clear about vertically opposite angles. I am. Vertically opposite angles are always equal. You got that right. Now let's move on to the exercises. 